What's up, what's up, what's up? I'll teach you two ways to fix a computer black screen. The first is so simple and has nothing to do with the BIOS or Windows or your operating system that is oftentimes overlooked in the forums. The second is how to reset the BIOS if you got the problem after a BIOS change. Hold on. What's up everyone? Thank you for supporting my channel by subscribing and liking my videos. This is Half Ball of Soup where everything goes. Make sure you check out my other more specific channels. As I said earlier, the first problem is so simple that it was hard for me to find the answer because I just went to, through this problem myself. I removed the video card on my rig and after that I had just a black screen. And finally, after digging everywhere, searching everywhere, finally, I, 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 there was one forum where, where one guy said, hey, did you check into this? And sure enough, that was the problem. Everybody else was talking about BIOS this, BIOS that, this, that, blah, 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 blah PCI, new cars. Okay, if you removed your video card and then um, uh, plug your uh, monitor to the mo motherboard and you got a black screen, the first thing you need to do before you mess with the BIOS is make sure that your CPU has an integrated graphics card. Yes, some, many, CPU to not have graphic cards integrated in them. So that's the first thing you need to do. If your card does not have it, you don't need to do anything else. What you need to do is get another video card, a cheap one or whatever. But if your CPU don't have an integrated videos card, you need to get a an external or dedicated, I should say, a dedicated graphics card to put back in the motherboard. And the way that you check for that is you find your CPU, uh, you know, number, uh, whatever the, the, the name is that is commonly known for and do a search is such and such CPU a or an APU Apple Peter umbrella APU Apple Peter umbrella. So you search for your CPU and you search for is my CPU such and such an APU and that will tell you uh, or you can just check the specs. If you check the specs and like mine, it, it just they just don't want to say it because they want to keep it like away from you. If you're if you do a search on your CPU specs and you don't see that it says it, that it doesn't even talk about integrated graphics card, most likely it doesn't have it. If it says it has one, then you move to try to, you know, reset the BIOS. Hey, if you find this video helpful, please hit the like button. If you need to reset your BIOS because of what we just talked about, it's not your problem, or because you were messing with the BIOS, and then you got the black screen or because of something you were doing might have messed with the BIOS. There are uh, a couple of ways to do it. Probably the first one you want to try is to unplug the computer, open up the case and um, find the Cosmos, uh, the clear Cosmos pins. It's two metal pins sticking up and it says next to it, uh, clear Cosmos or just Cosmos. Uh, you put a piece of metal in between the two to put a short on there. You, you hold it for at least five seconds and that should reset the uh, the BIOS. If you cannot find that, I mean, you, you want to look really hard and make sure you find that because that's the, that's the best way to do it. If uh, for if some way, somehow your motherboard don't have those, then you can try removing the motherboard battery for about 10 seconds and then putting it back on. 